Hey folks, Todd Bornschauer, Principal May River, and as is obvious to you at this point, I'm standing right out in front of the school, right in front of the administrative office area. Uh, by popular demand, we're going to create some video so you can see the interior space. We know you'll get locked up if you try to get in there without this, so we're going to give you a good feel. So right now we're in the auxiliary gym, and I am standing with your new athletic director, Brett Macy, and I'm going to turn it over to him and let him speak to you a bit. Welcome. Certainly glad to be here. Certainly love the opportunity that Mr. Bornshire has afforded me. Um, we're here in our auxiliary gym at May River High School. Um, it gives us a good feel of the field house. You'll see in pictures later our main gymnasium. Um, seats over 2,100 students and, and athletes and community members. It gives us a real feel of a small college. It's a big, it's a big field house with great lighting. Um, we're going to have great murals of the shark and our student athletes in our corridors and our hallways. So we're excited to Excited for you to be with us, excited to be here, and excited to get started. In addition to all the great you know, space we have in the gymnasium, we have a great giant trophy case. We're super excited to get started in August and start filling up. Behind me is our new weight room at May River High School. Uh, nice big wide room, um, well lighted. We probably fit about anywhere from eight to 12 personal stations for our student athletes um, to get bigger, stronger, faster. And that's what we're looking to do. This is typical of the science layout. It's very efficient. You'll have an oversized classroom for instruction and laboratory space a connecting storage area, and another lab classroom on the opposite side. As we've talked about our media center, uh, I want you to imagine the independent learning time and the expansiveness of this space and the opportunity for this to be a hub of the school around that lunch block and the opportunity for students to have freedoms. As she panned around, you saw outside is a beautiful courtyard area that will offer a good opportunity for us to be safe with students and also give them the opportunity for some fresh air during their day. All right, so I'm sitting in the control room in front of the auditorium, and behind me you'll notice one of the largest high school stages I've seen. Uh, this, this auditorium will hold about 620 people seated. Uh, you'll notice some pretty special things like catwalks uh, above the, the top there that you don't typically see in high schools, and there are two of those. first town hall meeting we were asked to get some video of the interior and give you a sense of what's to come we hope we've done that we hope you got we have you very fired up as she shows you a little bit of this exterior I want you to picture it lush and green and that beautiful view of the wood line and even retention ponds it's going to be a gorgeous place for your kids uh -huh. 